Hi everyone, thanks for watching my YouTube content. I'm Tang Kim. In this short video, I want to show you how to calculate the angle theta of two vectors in Excel and what it means in statistics. Alright, this is the uh, information from Wikipedia. Uh, I hope you are very familiar with inner product formula. So A dot B equals magnitude of vector A times magnitude of vector B times cosine theta, right? So let's think about a very simple example. A vector has two components and B vector has two components. Then cosine theta can be calculated by some product of A vector and B vector divided by square root of some sq of vector A. It means magnitude of vector A times square root of sum sq of vector v. Right, this is the result of uh, a inner product b divided by uh, magnitude of vector a times magnitude of vector v. Then angle can be calculated by degrees of arc cosine of this value. All right. So uh, let's try to understand what it means in statistics. So I prepared uh, simple data and let's get, uh, calculate uh, cosine theta. So before calculating uh, cosine theta, uh, I will uh, center the, uh, each variable. So data minus average of this variable average of x variable okay, then cosine theta can be calculated by some product of y variable and x variable divided by square root of some sq of beta y times square root of some sq of beta x then angle can be calculated by sign of this value. Right, only eight, uh, 8 degrees. So it means that two vectors, uh, two vectors has very uh, close uh, relationship, very uh, small angle between two vectors, right? So if we calculate correlation by using C-O-R-R-E-L function in Excel, As you can see, uh, correlation value is the same as cosine theta. So uh, if correlation uh, is very high, then you can expect uh, also very, uh, I mean same, uh, very high uh, value of cosine theta and the angle will be very small because two vectors goes in the same direction uh, but small angle. So I hope uh, this video uh, is useful to understand how to calculate uh, angle of two vectors and what it means in statistics. Please click like and subscribe if it was useful for you. Thank you.